Brian Baldinger, former NFL offensive lineman. A little bit of a film breakdown here from Trevor Lawrence, touchdown pass to the Jaguars rookie wide receiver Brian Thomas. So Jacksonville is up. Seven to nothing right here, late in second quarter. That's Brian Thomas Jr. right there, their first round pick. And right here, this is a Tampa 2 look. David Long's got him. And look at this adjustment to the ball, getting behind the underneath defender and then adjusting to it for his first NFL touchdown. He's so fluid. He's just so smooth in everything he does. This route right here, he's going to attack the middle linebacker, all right, and then he's going to stair step and cross his face, and Trevor's looking for him all the way. But this move right here to adjust to the ball, watch, watch his hands. Quick hands, knows exactly where he's at on that field, knows exactly where he's at on the field. Man, he's special. He's going to be a good player. He's going to be good in this offense. It's a heck of a throw by Trevor Lawrence, and that's a, that's a guy that's kind of trying to figure it out as well as a young quarterback. Yeah, I mean, it was a really nice uh, play by by Brian Thomas. I think Baldy's right. It was um, the the adjustment at the end, in particular, I think was the most impressive part of it. I think he kind of realized he was running into a safety and was able to at full speed make that slight adjustment beyond him and get to where the ball was going to be thrown. That was an absolutely ridiculous throw. I mean, as as Baldinger said, it's the Tampa two. Look, there's supposed to be a safety right there. That that's that's throwing the ball right into the top of that safety's coverage. And it's not like he has the entire field to to defend. There's a cap. You know, the end zone takes away, it limits how deep that guy needs to get. There are times where, you know, the Tampa two safety's got to defend vertically as far as you can go. Here, the end zone is stopping how far he needs to back up, and he's still beaten over the top by that ball. When he first put that in the air, um, if you look at the sideline view, the all-22 view, it does not look like a throw that's on. It doesn't look like there's space to put that ball in there. Uh, Mike Renner, former, formerly a PFF, now a CBS Sports, I mean, he posted the, the same view that Baldy did, the all-22, and said, look, look at when that ball is released, where uh, Brian Thomas is, again, does not look like there's any way they're going to connect where they connected in the end zone. A genuinely fantastic throw from Lawrence and uh, to his new receiver and a guy who does look like he has the fluid movement skills to be a really high impact player at this level.